it really hits home. Kickoff time is almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams that truly deserve to be on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and when it matters most? Stay with us on EA TV for the live action as it happens. And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And the bad news for them is that they have no chance of moving on to the knockout stages. It's Georgia up against Portugal. Well, they haven't been very good in the first couple of games. And of course, they're going home. But they still need to play well here and get some of their pride back. Let's hope they show a bit of spirit today. So we can check on the starting lineup. Well, they're going to play with a front two, which means they have to link up with each other as much as possible. If they do that well, they'll certainly pose a threat. It looks like a 5-3-2, really. And just over the bar. Really good effort. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Rui Patricio begins in goal. Bruno Fernandes plays alongside Ruben Neves in the centre of midfield. And leading the line today is Diogo Jota. That's useful play. Otavio. And he read it well defensively. Otar Kiteishvili. Sometimes you get to play just for pride. It has been confirmed that the home side tonight won't be progressing to the knockout stages of the competition. Well, obviously, these fans aren't happy, but it was always going to be a tough group for them. Let's hope they have something to cheer about today. Jota. Otavio. Return to Jota. To take the lead. Oh, a tremendous reflex action there from the keeper. Well, he didn't have long to react, did he? But that's a top-class save, I have to say. And over comes the corner. A really neat and drink to the keeper under the circumstances. Well, annoyingly giving it away. Jota. On to Bruno Fernandes. Can they forge ahead? No, chance missed. And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. Well, who will be the player to decide the outcome, to determine the course of events? No reason at all why it won't be this man, Stuart. What do you anticipate seeing from him? Well, Derek, we know he loves linking up with other players, but it's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous. When he oh, hang it. on, Stuart, it's a chance. Oh, disappointing, just when it looked like a surefire opener. Well, that should have been the opener, Derek. I'm not sure how he's missed that. Kocharashvili. Zuriko Davitashvili. A very good tackle. Well, Portugal might be onto something. Can he give them the lead? Well, there is the opening goal. The pressure finally telling, and they get the due reward. Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. back underway and 1-0 it is let's see what happens next Zuriko Davitashvili
Kiteshvili. Might really be able to trouble them here. Chance to cross. Not the most confident clearance. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Ruben Neves. Nicely cut out. Ottavio. Moving the ball forward with purpose. That's a nice looking ball. Well, plenty of power there, but in fairness, should have made the keeper work. Bruno Fernandes has it. On the ball, Joao Felix. Well, sitting deep like this might be a dangerous game. Nicely timed tackle. Otar Kakabadze. And the referee playing advantage. Well, still searching for the equaliser, but not passing it anxiously. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Well, now he's let that run out of play, and it will be a throw in here. Guerrero. And this is Diogo Jota now. Bruno Fernandes has it. On the ball, Joao Felix. Could cross it in here. Joao Felix, real chance. Oh, a challenge of the highest order. Felix, on to Bruno Fernandes. Neves, on to Fernandes. Otavio, and on to Felix. Joao Felix. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well-balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So, back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. Kiteshvili. Bruno Fernandes has it. Portugal looking dangerous. Might work out. And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box, and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Joao Felix getting the better of his opponent. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Bruno Fernandes has it. Return to Jota.
Bruno Fernandes. Opportunity. Well, that's really sound goalkeeping, not letting the opposition have any scraps. Really clever pressing. And in terms of added time, a minimum of one minute. Levan Schengelia. Well, good run and good ball control. And with that, the first half draws to a close. Underway again, and certainly dazzling football from Portugal in the first half. Will it be more of the same in the second? Fernandes, determined defending. Now counter-attacking possibilities. And just like that, the counter-attack comes to an end. Well, space for them here. Crossed accurately towards the far post. And the problem not completely solved. And a time for calm on the ball. Jota. Leal. Good looking move this. Wonderful chance. Well, he opted for power from close range. He might be regretting that now. Kiteshvili. They've given it away. And Portugal showing good wins. Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. Well, those stats tell you everything. They're opening up the opposition at will. And while we've seen some really poor defending, their attacking play has been excellent. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Portugal being afforded too much space here. It's got to be! Oh no, not the greatest of efforts, was it? Well, I think I can say he's made a real mess of that. Well, as you can see, the skill to set up this chance is absolutely brilliant. And once he gets onto it, he just smashes it past the keeper with great technique. What an emphatic finish that is. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Otar Kiteishvili. Kocharashvili. Lasha Dvali. Otar Kakabadze. Well, he's given us away. Advantage played. Otavia. Losing possession. Felix. And quick thinking defensively. Take it away. 
Joao Felix. And the cross comes to nothing. Good piece of closing down. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Joao Felix! And able to close down the shot. Levan Schengelia. Effective challenge. And defensive play to be applauded. And easily intercepted. Mikael Tadze. Otar Kiteishvili. An alert intervention. Into the final 20 minutes. Excellent vision. Couldn't beat the keeper, unfortunately for him. Well, I think that's a bad miss. He just never looked convincing as he went through there. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. And cutting it out. Ottavio. Ottavio. Good looking cross. Goalkeeping of the highest order. Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. He's driven in the corner. Couldn't quite keep it down. Goal kick. And Portugal struggling to keep the ball. A quarter of an hour remaining here. Joao Felix, opportunity, and the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Let's see about the delivery. Oh, a really good header, but the goalkeeper there's a cover up. Corner once more. Oh, splendid header, but a fine save. Ruben Neves. Could be threatening. Blocked it brilliantly. And he's gone into an illegal position, unfortunately. Kiteishvili. George Mikau Tadze. Perfect tackle. Kiteishvili. Careless in possession. Can he find the right pass? Gonzalo Ramos feeding it through and he's through and a goal he's put it away a celebratory moment well first of all where's the defending they're all over the place but give him some credit that's a good finish great composure Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. A foul, but advantage played. Delivered into the area here. Well, a struggle to get it away properly. 
And he's lost custody of the ball here. Georgi Kocharashvili. That's a good ball. Getting in there to intercept. Not the best challenge, free kick. And they've been getting two substitutes warmed up and both will come on here. Palinha. Ramos. Just couldn't get it through. Playing it in. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Ramos. He's got to score! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And mopping up defensively. See some progress with the ball at his feet. Pulls it back. And the final whistle here. A real sense of feel good in the Portuguese camp on the back of this victory, Stuart. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all round performance. And at the final analysis, a top-level contribution from Diogo Jota. How many times do we say that? The answer is rather a lot. Stuart, what did you make of what he put into the game? Well, he was on fire today, not just with his finishing.